Buenos días, buenos días Portland y bienvenidos a la escuela. Hoy es viernes. Hoy es viernes. Good morning, Portland. Today is Friday, March 13th. Welcome to school today. We are continuing our focus on patience. Have you ever tried to teach someone how to play a game or to learn a new skill? Teaching someone something takes a lot of patience. Think about your teachers and were they patient with you? Did they give you time to figure new things out? Thank someone today has shown patience to you as you have learned something new. We have lots of students to recognize that have are new to the reading wall and that have been busy moving up on the reading wall. These students are new to the reading wall and have read their first 10 books and have earned their Frisch's Big Boy Certificates. Jonathan Mulrooney, Anaya Smith, Trayana Anderson, Summer Napier, Trayvon Norfleet, E.J. Weinbrenner, Madeline Witt, Cordelia Williams, Jeffrey Barber, Navaya Langness, Amariana Johnson, Natalie Burt, Jacob Jennings. These students are moving on up. Nyla Patterson, Deontay Vaughn, Naya Harris, Brianna O'Neill, Triton O'Neill, and Jada Berry. Congratulations to all of you as you are working on being 100 books smarter. Do you know that by reading 100 books, you could even move up one whole grade level in reading. That means if you read as a first grader and you read 100 books, that could make you on level as a second grader. Get busy reading. That will move you up a whole grade. Caught being good. Congratulations to these students. Meet us at the prize cabinet by 930. Chevy Lynch, Anaya Fournay, John Asia Miller, Destiny O'Neill, Andrew Willis, Paris Bowles, Summer O'Neill, Gabby Isles, Triton Culver, Deontay Vaughn, Joseph Jordan, Lauren Garner, Chase Stedman, Jake. I'm not sure, last name Jones. Maria Johnson, Lexi Combs, Carly Portman, Andre Payne, Trenton O'Neill, Talia Stevenson. Congratulations on Caught Being Good. Those of you that are working hard on earning those Caught Being Good tickets, keep up the great work. We are very proud of you. We're continuing our focus on student and what that means for um, what it looks like, what your teachers are doing, and what they do for you in the classroom. Our letter for the day is N, and the word is nurture. What does it mean to have nurture in the classroom? It means that your teacher in the class makes you feel like he or she really cares about you. If you are sad or angry, your teacher helps you to feel better. Your teacher seems to know if something is bothering you. Finally, your teacher gives you time to explain your ideas. When your teacher does those four things, your teacher is helping to nurture you. 
We have one more letter to go and we will have learned all about student voice and what that means for how a teacher works to help you be successful. You should have had um, your plums this week and today should be sweetie day. I hope you enjoy your sweeties. We have a great thing happening tonight. It's our Portland basketball um, team is in the final four. Come out and cheer Portland on at 6.30 tonight at Brown School. Let's have a fabulous Friday. Just real quick, I have a correction about our great basketball um, game tonight. We will be in the Final Four Championship, and that is at 615 at the Brown School. Come on out and cheer on the Portland Panthers. We are in the Final Four, and if we win that game, the next game will be at 830. So we could have two games tonight. Let's cheer on the Panthers, and let's help them get through the whole championship. Go, Portland! Que tengan un buen día.